This is a wonderful program. We're in the process of taking this to the next level. And so we're here now at, at Napa Valley. We've got 25 uh, young airmen and Marines. The industry leaders are here from the National Restaurant Association, both the military as well as the civilian leadership. It's really good being here working with our brothers and sisters in arms. I've never had an opportunity to work with the Air Force and I've really enjoyed us coming together as a team and working together with the students at CIA and the chefs. One of the responsibilities that I have under my command is food services for the Marine Corps. And uh, so this is uh, just a really unique and rare opportunity for some of our Marines that have excelled uh, in their field in cooking. We take the best of the best, we bring them here, and they get a, an unbelievable week of training. Now that I'm here and I actually experienced uh, this one week, it felt really good for me that I know that food service is a, another good opportunity because food service is the number one essential throughout the world. We find this program to be one of the best in the business. It's uh, not only personally rewarding, but it's, uh, it's great corporate citizenship. We're very honored to have uh, the National Restaurant Association Military Foundation here on our campus. Personally, it's, uh, it's an opportunity for all of us to thank the servicemen and women. Uh, we don't always get an opportunity to do that. They taught us a lot about food and how they can manipulate it and be also passionate about what you can do. Also, it motivated me to pursue this career. Now that I have passion now, I can I honestly say that, you know what, let's do this. Let's, let's, let's do it, let's pursue it. I've learned that you could take a certain recipe and make it taste so much better with simple stuff that we have available in our dining facility. It's an amazing thing. I am so interested in food science now, you would not believe, because of certain things they said. Also vegetarian cooking, ways to cook lighter, that was one of my favorite classes too. Through some of this experience that they're gaining with us today, they'll decide to move into food service and once we get them, we got them hooked. There's a myriad of opportunities out there, but without a guide, you know, somebody's been there and done that, it's kind of hard to figure out. They want to tell you about their careers and ways that you can go into the industry if you want to get out of the military or when you get out of the military. And it's nice to see that people care so much. And throughout the years I've been in food service, um, in the military, I built my character. I was able to have confidence and I'm really excited about pursuing this food service industry. And I guess I was blessed with the, the knowledge and the opportunities that is out there. Just the experience, being able to do this and just cooking different things, learning different things, seeing like top chefs, it's awesome. You don't know how fulfilling this is until you actually get in and do it. It's been so enlightening for me and my company. These are high quality people and we can certainly use them and embrace them in the food service world. The skills that they learn here and, and the instructors that they have here are just not uh, things that could be replicated easily in the field. They learn some tremendous skills. They'll be able to share these techniques and some of the things that they've learned here that I think will not only benefit them as individuals and as Marines, but uh, all of those that are going through their serving line as well. It opened the door to a lot of opportunities and I'm truly grateful. This is great. It lets you know that there are people out there that does appreciate us and would like to do more for us. This is amazing. This is amazing. I'm really happy that we had this opportunity.